artist stuck packs in here. Welcome to my vlog. I intended to do some vlogging this weekend to continue on the three days of daily vlogs I had. Now, I'm not committed to the daily vlog at all, but I wanted to do a week's worth. Unfortunately, Minnesota weather, it hampered the things I wanted it to do because A, freezing temperatures are coming overnight and uh, a couple big snowstorms are predicted uh, in the next few days throughout this week. So I had to do some outdoor work and I don't want to bore you with kind of day-to-day -day stuff. So let's move on from there. Today, I just want to kind of talk about, um, here, I'll just kind of read you kind of what I wrote the other day um, in my journal, since this is something I think can be helpful to a lot of you and helps me get this out into the universe, because I can say I'm going to be doing things but do I do them? Unless I get them out in the universe. So that's where this is. So I wrote this on the 17th. Some days I plan out what I want to do in advance. Today and or tomorrow I'll do ABC. When the time comes, the universe says, you need to do ZYX. I often have a choice at this point. Do I do what I plan to do? Or should I be flexible and do what the universe is hinting at? I always know what I should do, but I don't always follow my intuition. This is almost always a bad uh, choice. I know I should pivot and take cues from the universe or make bad decisions and plow through. So the other week, I was uh, hoping to get into the studio uh, part of Saturday and most of the day on Sunday. I had some yard stuff that I wanted to do. The yard's always an uh, issue. Come Friday night, a neighbor asked me if I could uh, chop up some very large fallen limbs, you know, in the 18, you know, 30 foot long ones. Uh, they had fallen a month prior when we had a tornado come over the house and tore down some trees down, down the hill and on my, my neighbor's yard next door. I had volunteered uh, to do it when it happened. Uh, my neighbor, she thought insurance should uh, have to pay for it and uh, was waiting out for some professional things. Unfortunately, insurance didn't pay for it. So I agreed to change my plans and uh, took care of the tree uh, Saturday morning with the help of uh, my love tea. Um, four hours later, exhausted, I didn't get into the studio, I was planning happy hour later on in the evening, uh, but we ended up meeting some friends at a brewery because you know, A, we were exhausted and B, we thought doing a little earlier, little thing on the patio would be nice since it was sunny and, and all that good stuff. It was about one o'clock when that happened hadn't seen them in a long while. It was fun, yes, but I didn't get my done, as it were. And well, it happened that a second brewery uh, came into being. <laughs> we didn't get home till late uh, and we crashed. 
guess what didn't happen on Sunday? No studio time, because my hangover ass could not do much more than read all day. So two wasted days for agreeing to do something, pushing off the plans I wanted to do. But I did feel good about helping the neighbor since she's old and couldn't do it and doesn't have much disposable income. So the moral of the story is, and I mean, it's, it's not a perfect story for what I was talking about in the beginning, but sometimes life, the world, and situations out of your control and then giving up on your plans can have consequential things in your practice when you're an artist because it's so easy to push off studio time, push off the creative stuff. So my recommendation is try to stick to your creative plans because make a meeting, do something to make it as important as all of the other things that come up barrage you and all that good stuff. So I don't want to say much more. I want to keep some of these daily vlogs quick, simple, until I get really into um, painting again um, on this channel, which will happen in tutorials and talking about very specific things. So I hope you stick around. Uh, I will be reading from my journal some more. My action items list has gotten bigger. Um, we'll go over that maybe tomorrow. All right, see you later.